talking. That is how the Japanese call a clock. I'm quite sure she told me that. It's a curious thing to do. Most foreigners just teach her how to count. Shit, she is late. Marianne hasn't responded yet either. It's gone seven o'clock. Definitely left the office now. I shouldn't have left her. Or should have called her. Damn fine. I need to start focusing on work. Yeah, I, I really need this date. It's good. And Jerry's going to be angry if I mess it up too, the way he arranged it. Ah. Those guys always get me into situations like this. Probably... No, they wouldn't get started at seven. Would they? Might be doing shots over at Monty's. Nah, no, Monty. Mm. It's quite right to use a pseudonym. Mm. It's getting quite late to show up. Nobody would show up this late on meetings. Ten minutes. Might have just missed a bus, of course. Yes. Lovely mica. Pretty eyes. Very elegant. The Japanese always know how to dress, that's a given. Oh, shit, what if she doesn't show up? It's been ten minutes. Hmm, I'm getting quite hungry. Did I even lunch? Can't remember what I've had for lunch. I was doing that report. Not that Marianne will read that until Friday. She's good to have done still. Ah, oh, shit. This was the only chance I had as well. Never meeting people like that. Jerry was right. I should be happy at least he is looking out for my sex life. <laughs> Which is a bit crude. Okay, I, I have to call my nose. I'd better just take a sip of wine. Nothing wrong with just a sip of wine. Yeah, yeah, go on then. It will stop me from thinking so much. I feel a bit bad about starting to eat. I can't just drink wine though. Will it look odd? I'll just pretend I didn't when the door rings. Should be time enough. I'll just go, just a minute. <laughs> just a minute. I don't know, just eating bread by myself here. Mm. If I had just let it be dancing with the guys at my go. I would have been sure she'd see me. Yeah, Jerry is always right. Mr. Donald was right as well. I need to focus my talents. Seek my inner self. Such floaty words. But then Mr. Donald is helping me relocate. I can't always work for Johnson. Why well, he doesn't just fire Marianne. And himself. And um, what does Johnson do these days? Just sits at his desk fiddling his iPhone and having trivial conversations with the clients I get for him. Oh yes, he does all the lunches. It's a business expense. Probably too late to go riding. I could do with a bit of fresh air. No, no, the wine. The wine. And Maiko. Oh, they are right, aren't they? I just don't seem to care. Here's a pretty girl coming over for the first time in... God knows how long a time. Mm. What did Byron write? She turned upon a pillow, pill she lay, her dark eyes flashing through her tears like... 
like something. When will I read poetry to someone anyway? Well, probably would be wasted on Micah. Nothing under 120 BPM can please her. Huh. Wouldn't mind giving her something over 120 BPM. <laughs> ah, that was really bad. I do want sex with her though. Her slender legs. See her cry out with joy. It's nice to think of her. It's good bread. <clears throat> and a good tabernacle. I'm actually quite good at that. Yeah. MS O'Donnell will sort the work out. I can't wait to leave them. Let them go down the drain. Marianne probably couldn't even file for bankruptcy. Yeah. What am I worrying about anyway? Michael's not showing up. So what? I'll just spend the night doing something useful. Something useful. Jerry will love that. Well, fuck Jerry. I'll just move on to the soup. I'm not that hungry anymore. I really just want to go do something now. Have another glass. Yeah, I could have that. It's probably not coming. I, I might as well have a nice drink then. Oh, go on. I can work with two glasses. Smell good. Yeah, Michael has no idea what she's missing. She's probably just dancing, God knows what now. It's almost eight. Probably we'll take the bike to work tomorrow. Can go to the countryside afterwards. Take the highway through that. That is rather good. Might go to a restaurant on the way back. Italian. Take a book with me. And I'll be sitting there alone. Reading a book. A bike of dancing, that was rather nice. Hmm. How do I always get along with these guys? They always call me. She probably tried to reach me. Or they would. Mr. Donald doesn't really cut it. He's successful, makes me successful, or so I think. But he's not really fun. Yeah, I'm just pumping myself up here. The soup might be nice, and I have a bike, a paycheck that'll soon buy me a way out of this house. I'm not too bad looking. But I don't really use it that much. Biking and reading doesn't really get you into touch with the other sex. They are right, really. I should just go out with them, instead of quoting Byron to myself. Get a few drinks down, dance with someone, pull a girl, pull a chick. <laughs> pull a chick. I should just give in. Nobody. Nobody can dance without a few drinks in them anyway. Perhaps I'll just go after this. I drink too much to be useful here anyway. Oh, just drunk after two glasses of wine. It's probably because of this skip lunch. Where will they hang out now? I could go there. It doesn't really matter being hang out didn't work, I worked ahead. Not that damn Johnson ever checks. Yeah, they should invent an app for that. I can't believe Michael didn't show up. I was so hoping to. And she seemed to like me. Did she? I can never tell. After a few drinks, everybody kisses anybody anyway. It's 
Who else did she kiss? It's not Jerry, I think. <laughs> she might think we all look the same, but would she kiss Jerry? Um, God knows the Japanese can't hold a liquor. When was she going back? A few months. Not much time left if I want to shag her. Is that all it is now? Shagging. That is exactly what Jerry's talking about. All that thinking. I should just let go. I need another glass of wine. Or a bottle. I might as well finish this night drunk. Reset my brain. She won't show up. She doesn't need the wine. Here I go. When am I going to have a good relationship again? I thought that might be possible with my gun. I'm not saying the one, just, you know. Jerry might be still in university, but at least he's getting laid. Not just a shagging, just someone to hold. God knows I'm not meeting anyone biking or sitting in the office. Yeah, Marianne. She's quite good looking. Shag worthy, I suppose. Just... <clears throat> not sure. She ceased and turned upon a pillow pill. Her dark curl shading her one cheek. That's different, isn't it? I can never remember this poem. <sighs> Damn. Damn! I can't stand she didn't show up. So much depended on it, didn't it? <clears throat> it's not about her. It is about me. I've been this way for years now. It's 27 and still... Damn, 27. And hanging out with 20 year old Japanese girls. It's very smooth. Perhaps I should just give up on love. Forget about it. If it's all going to be 20 year old girls dancing to that, that, that music, and just let the guys go by themselves. Why are they still inviting me to go with them? Why am I still going anyway? I never get to read my poetry with all the going out or to bike, or really to advance my career, but at least with them I'm happy. Or just drunk anyway. Perhaps should give it up, gonna move on, being 27. She ceased and turned upon her pillow. Pale she lay, her dark eyes flashing through the tears. Yeah, that's it, that's it. Hmm. She ceased and turned upon her pillow. Pale she lay, her dark eyes flashing through her tears like clouds that rain and lighten. Like a veil waved and overshading her one cheek appears her streaming hair. The black curls... Oh, fuck giving it up, here she is.
fucking neighbors. Damn. I'll just go search the guys. Get my coat. Thank <laughs> you. 